What is good? Today on ARMS, even though I'm not playing currently, I'm actually talking over the footage that I played over last time when I played the last weekend it was out. <gasps> Today we're playing- No, I'm fucking stupid. Today, I'm gonna be commentating the disgusting, destructive sessions I had with my man Mummy something. I don't remember his actual name, but it was something Mummy because he's a fucking mummy if you can't see that for yourself. I played as the mummy and I beat that ass to- Disgustingly, it was so bad. I had to cover my mouth a few times over what I did. So let's begin. If I'm not mistaken, this was my first ever match that I used with Master Mummy, which kind of broke my cherry, which made me the Mummy Master. At, well, not right away, of course, with a lot of practice, okay? But this is where I set the groundwork. So my left arm shoots out three punches, which is kind of cool. My right arm shoots out a bird named Paul. Now these matches happened so far, or, I mean long ago rather, it, it's like Wednesday now. I don't exactly remember what I did, what happened, who won or lost, but I do remember me beating that ass. So let's commentate this from, you know, ground zero, if you will. So me, my, my man Paul didn't do shit. Ninjara almost dead. I don't think I'm gonna be able to kill him in time. Ooh, okay, my memory is not completely shit. I hit the bomb and the bomb missed Ribbon Girl. That's cool. Oh, my, my, ni my nipples got hit. I watched that. That didn't feel good after, like, seeing it. You know what I'm saying? I don't like seeing my nipples get hit. Not a nice feeling. I have an ultimate and I use it too. Oh, look at me. Look at me. Look at me. Fuck on me. Okay, what am I doing now? I'm hitting. Paul's going. Paul didn't do shit. Ribbon Girl didn't. I, 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 I don't. I don't know what's happening. I think I'm just throwing through so much pressure. Ribbon Girl can't do shit. Her arms look a little bit disabled. They have the little. Oh shit! She got the grab. She had the little like uh, explanation, exclam exclamation, fuck, exclamation, yellow shit. I don't know what that means. Let me know down below. And I, damn. <laughs> this happened so fucking quick. I didn't even get a chance to properly talk. Oh, look at me though. Moving right along, folks. We are on match number two. I don't know what I'm about to do. I think I'm about to do the same setup. It looks like four, three. Uh, okay. Ooh, no, I fucked it up. I think I didn't think I wanted that. I don't like the mega ton punch. It's so slow. But so I have the slow, unreally blockable mega ton punch, which does a lot of damage, but it's not the best thing when it comes to like speed and accuracy. It, it's more like the. <clears throat> you know what I'm saying? So I still got the birdie Paul in my right hand, so it's not completely trash for me just yet. We're doing a team battle, I think, if I'm not mistaken. I am not doing that bad in a team battle. Oh, also, you know, I, I'll, I'll save for the next fight. Stick tuned to that. We're losing pretty badly, though. My teammate's getting trashed on. We got health, though. I'm getting the health. My teammate doesn't know how to properly drink it. Oh, and he's dead. So now it's 2v1. Oh, no. Oh, I got hit. Okay, I thought I was going to get my ultimate on him, but no. I, I, I remember how this went. I'm going to let you know. Spoiler alert. I didn't end up on top. Nope, not at all. And I'm <laughs> I'm dead. Okay. That's that's pleasant to see. Helps me get my... Oh, no. Ah, uh, ah, uh, Karma. I guess that is karma. Now this fight was very interesting. I remember this very accurately because the dude who I'm fighting against now had the most points in the lobby that I was in, but that's besides the point. What I was gonna mention before that I didn't have enough time to mention <sighs> was if you smash this like button 10,000 times, I will breathe that much more oxygen every per like. So that means I will live extra long. <laughs> what does that mean? Who knows? So I got three um, punches on both arms. The, the, the three punch arm cannon rocket launcher bitch thing. I don't know what you call it. So technically I got six punches on deck. Now, with him being the best player in this current lobby, I knew I had to think to myself, how am I going to get past, like, like what is he going to do, rather? That was my mindset, because he, he didn't get all those wins for nothing. So far, we're playing the keep away game. The health came back, so I was very close to it. I felt like he was going to grab, and I don't know if he did right there in that instance, but I remember thinking that when I was in the health. I have an ultimate. Am I going to use it? It's the real question. I feel like if I do, it can change the big tide of the battle. Don't know if I'm smart or not. Let's figure out, folks, together. Oh, I'm smart. I did it right when he launched his fist so he couldn't block, and that is what I like to see. Now, there's a very competitive aspect to this when you really look at it closely. It's not very complex like Tekken or Mortal Kombat or even Injustice 2 for that matter, but it's more like quick thinking, you know? Your, your, your gut feeling, your instincts on movement and shit like that. Anyways, that ultimate really helped me out a lot because I got such a disgusting lead. I can go smoke a cig and come back. Don't smoke, kids. Don't smoke. Got another ultimate, so does he. Because I got such a great late lead, I'm not afraid about nothing. I'm blocking at a fear for the ultimate, hit the bomb. He got the grab, which was a smart grab. And I'm thinking to myself, should I do the ultimate? And I did it. Ooh, I remember this so clearly. I, uh, look at me, look at me, fuck on me. It looks so cool to an instant replay. Like all those fists, bitch. 
Oh, and the overkill fist. Look, ah! on to the next match. We have volleyball. Not a fan of it, as I mentioned several times before, but I got better at it. Now, because I'm good at it, or at least more proficient even, doesn't mean I like this shit. It just means I can put up with it. As I'm about to get a point, if he's stupid, no, he's not. Can I please hit it over? Yes, okay. Now, I've been actually wrecking very, like, with the, the three punch, oh shit, he spiked me. With the three punch arms, it, it really helps a lot with volleyball. Don't know if there's a better pair of arms that helped with that, but later on, you're going to see that I've learned the art of spiking. If I care to show that match, if I even recorded it, who remembers? Not me, bitch. So, 2-1. Don't remember if he gets a point past that, too, but <laughs> or that one, rather. But right now, it's looking like he's not. I I'm getting him in my Zenkai boost mode, bitch, if you watch Dragon Ball Z. Look at it. Fuck on me. Look at me. Can I get one more for the one more? I think I can. Look at him. Look at him. Struggling. Look at him. Nervous. Look at him. Sweating. Oh, okay, and I think five seconds left, and I won, so what, <laughs> why count? On to the next match, we have Ribbon Girl. Now, I picked my six-arm setup once again because I've been putting in work. Like, if something gives you results, don't back down, okay? Keep on getting them results. Now, with that being said, I don't remember if this Ribbon Girl was the infamous one that I remember on top of my head that spammed the grab. She might be with seeing those grabs back to back, but I can't tell, folks. Now, I'll let you know, I'm seeing grab spam is one thing that's very annoying in this game. If you have someone like Mummy Man, Mummy Master, Master Mummy, I think, okay. Because he is slow. So with him being slow and someone being faster to just grab you whenever the fuck they choose, you're kind of a bitch, you know? You can't really do what you want, and you do what they want you to do. Doesn't feel good, but hey. So I'm losing by a little bit. My ultimate could turn it around, but I got to be selective with how I use it. I'm waiting for it to throw that punch, I think. Nope, got a little bit eager. Still pulled it off. And with that, I kind of got in the league. Block, block, ay, and I blocked it. I meant lead, but I said league. Excuse me. I don't like League of Legends. Moving onwards, the grab. Block that shit. Okay, with how she's grabbing, what I remember, this is not the ribbon girl that spammed the absolute piss out of me with the grab. But even still, I don't like the grab. You can obviously punch it out the way. But when they move in a certain way and they try to grab you back to back to back, like I mentioned, you're a bitch, okay? Now, with how our health is looking and the fact that I have my ultimate again, if I do it, that's my win condition right away, and that's it for me. Oh, it for her, I mean, but she threw me. I decided let's finish this, little girl. And lucky for her, she fell back to where I couldn't hit her with the rest of the punches that would have ended her life. So because of that, she's living a little bit longer. Throwing some, throwing some, <laughs> throwing some grabs in my direction. Don't like it, so I throw one back. And with that grab... That's, that's that, okay? Now, look, get that replay, get that, get that. Uh, 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 I pissed a little bit at that because it vibrated my desk. So many matches, so little time. We are once again with Master Mummy. I'm gonna have the Paul on my left arm this time and the six arm, I mean, three arm set up on my right arm. <laughs> now, this map is so annoying for so many reasons. I've learned that people like to hide behind the little tubes. Look at the bitch. Look at the bitch. He's not doing it right now. Um, some people are really good at hiding. Some people are not really good at it. Like my friend, I can't read his name. Uh, we're gonna call him Spring Man. I think that's his actual name. Now, I have the health container in my vicinity right next to me. So does he. A little bit upset because he's gaining just as much health as I did. But I got the ultimate. And with that, I'm gonna take the lead. Very easily, very quick. I like that. Clap, clap. Okay, moving on. Got the punches. Got no punches. Got low health. He's almost dead. Hold your breath. He dodged the shit. Now hit that bitch in the motherfucking chin. And just like that, kids, that's how you... That's how you make a homicide happen. I don't know what to say. Now, I'm really curious to see what the tier list for arms is going to be looking like. I don't really know, man. I thought my man uh, Min Min was tight, high, high tier, which I still think she is. My man Master Mummy could be up there. He's slow as fuck, but even when he blocks, he gets HP back. I forgot to mention that because I was so focused on offense, I haven't been doing it. But nevertheless, here I am on a 2v2 setting with my man Ninjaro, it looks like. Got my man Paul on the right. Three arms in the left, and we just gonna win it. You know what I'm saying? I could talk about the fight, but you kind of know. Oh, <laughs> look at that, look at that, look at it, look at it. Okay, you know how it's gonna go. I mean, maybe, who knows? Health in the middle. Moving on, though. Um, I'm curious to see how many of you guys who, who are watching this who do not have a Switch yet. Let me know down below if you don't have a Switch and what games do you want for it, including arms, if so be it. And I don't know, man. I, I'm really feeling like Oprah with the giveaways, so if, if I can get my hands on an uh, extra Switch because I'm trying to get one for my friend, I might bless one of y'all in the comments of this video. We'll see, though. We'll see, though. Right now, let me focus on giving away this Injustice 2 copy, but moving on. Teammates down. 
Other teammates down on his side. 1v1. I blocked the ultimate. Hit him with Paul on the right hand. And then we got the grab, which could finish it. Nope, not yet. So I will finish it with the ultimate. And I he dodged. Oh, shit. I remember I did the ultimate, but I don't remember if I won. Okay, his health is also... Okay, I did win. <laughs> I was a little bit worried for myself there. Here we are with the final fight. Now, this was the best out of all the sessions I've had because everybody who's in this lobby right now was the best of the best from the lobby I was in as a whole. Not only that, this was the last fight that we had before the lobby closed down. So that was just... I like it. So with that being said, um, the Min Min, she likes to grab a lot. She grabs spams every time she gets a chance. And the Spring Man, he loves to hide. He fucking craves it. Now, Min Min was slipping. I, I took the opportunity to beat her ass, which I'm glad I did, as I got punched in my shoulder. That's not nice. So it's a little bit difficult because he's hiding, and then he tries to get that curve punch, as you see. And if you're not paying attention, you catch yourself slipping like I just did. Dodge the grab, thankfully, because M Master Mummy is very slow, and he's not really good at dodging grabs. Um, I, I caught Min Min slipping. Not really the smartest of things to do, but I blocked her ultimate pretty nicely. Um, would be really smart for me and her to team up on Spring Man, because I'm sure at this point, me and her, or him if it's actually a guy, both know that the person who plays Spring Man, he, he wins a lot because he hides a lot. So it's better in our interest, best interest for both of us to work together. But we don't know how to do that, as you can see. We're, we're not having any type of camaraderie. It's fine, though. I'm getting fucked up, about to die, but Min Min comes to my aid, and I have my ultimate, so with that, I <laughs> betray the fuck out of Min Min. Oh my gosh. Right now, we're all even. I see the health. I creep my way ever so slowly to the health, and with this, I signify my W, boy. Ah! Oh, it was like chess. The minute I moved to the health, it was over. Let me get in my black girl mode. Oh, fuck! With that being said, let me know down below what you think about my man Master Mummy and if he is the best Master Mummy you ever seen. Probably not. I'm being a little bit extra, but that's fine because extra's better than normal.